Hi everybody, welcome back to Honestly KDP. My name is Laura and I had a request to see if I knew how to do a half drop repeating pattern. Um, so that's what this video is going to be about. Now it is not seamless. I haven't figured out how to make these seamless, but uh, they do still sell. I can say that from experience. So basically what I would do to create this, um, these are some clip arts that I created in Mid Journey. So I would just take three main images and try to make them about the same size. And then I would kind of fill in the space around them. Or sometimes what I do is I just do two rows of three. Like if I, if my shapes are a little bit odd and I can't get them to fit together that way, I just create two rows of three like this. And then And then I just play with it until things look like they're sized about right. And there's not too big of a gap in between anything. I'm going to make sure, especially on the ends, that they're kind of even on the ends um, so that it'll fit together properly. All right, and then what I do is I just collect it all like this and shrink it down. Now, how big you're going to make it is going to depend on, like, like how big do you Im want your images to be on the page? So usually I do either two across, like make it this halfway to the page, or in this case, I feel like that's going to be too big. So I will make room for there to be three across. Um, so I just will duplicate that. Try to get it even to fit in there nicely so they're not too far apart. And then duplicate it again, and it should go to the right spot. And just collect all of them and you know make sure that it's even on the end and nothing's cut off <clears throat> you know get bring it all the way to the edges so it looks right and then from there I will duplicate this and then just pull it over and try to fit it in there nicely and then duplicate it again and it should go down properly if not you can fit it into the same into the correct spot and then from here i duplicate it again and bring it over here try to make sure it's the same distancing And then just work your way up. Yeah, just make sure everything is spaced right so it doesn't look weird when you zoom out, you know, the pattern should look even. And that's it. That's how you do that. That's how I do the half drop um, repeating pattern. These look a little bit small. I probably could have made them a little bit bigger, but um, that is how I do it. You can save this as a transparent PNG. Here, I'll just take this and open it up. And I'll try to first uh, pick the background 
So you can choose a background color since it's transparent, if you want it to be yellow to match the sunflowers or green or pink or something. I liked the yellow and then if you like want it a little bit lighter you can always just go up here and use the slider. I like to use pretty pastel colors and then here when you spread this out what you can do is just keep going just spread it out to the size that you want it to be. Um, there's your half drop repeating pattern um, the way that I do it. And that is all for this video, and I will have another one um, coming out very soon. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.